Hey guys, here on New Year's, I thought, wouldn't it be good for me to make a video to help tell people how Rescue Pets is actually helping animals. So, here's what it is, you know. I want to talk about two things. One is what we currently do and how we do it, which is interesting because we're new and we've already made it a good difference in some animals' lives, you know. And the other thing is what our long-term vision is. And with that, I want to say how, you know, we've already helped a dog. You know, we sponsored a dog with Dog on Seattle. His name was Treble. He was saved from a kill shelter. Um, what Dog on Seattle does is they find dogs in other states and kill shelters and they go ahead and um, pay the fees to transport them down to Seattle. And... <sighs> and um, put them in foster homes so that they can find their forever home. Which for Treble, it only took two weeks until he found his forever home. And here he is, he's still happy, alive, thanks to players like you who played rescue pets and paid in it. Um, and I thank you so much for that. Like, oh, you can't believe how, how good it actually feels, you know, because I set out uh, after quitting Amazon a year and a half ago, I set out to do this mission to save animals and it's great to actually see the first big success story. But it's not the only thing we've done. You know, we've also um, used our social media somewhat to spread some information about pets to help people understand uh, how to take care of their dogs better. And that's something I'd like to do more of too, especially, um, it's hard for me to do social media stuff, so, you know. I'm really like trying to practice that, especially in this year. Um, and like th those two goals, you know, those, those two things we've already done is just part of the larger vision. In the future, what I want is really in three big pillars. This is how we're going to help animals, three pillars. One is do more adoptions like Triple. We are going to help him, not help him, but help other animals find homes just like him. And not just in doggone Seattle, but across America. And I think that and not, not just America either, the whole world. Um, and that'll take time, but you know, sponsoring adoptions and uh, other things that animal shelters need is a big mission of mine with this game. And that's a direct way to say, ah, this money helps save a dog. Right. The other pillar, pillar two, is what I talk about spreading awareness. Um, and there's like two elements to it, really. One is spreading awareness to normal individual people because um, people, you know, they, a lot of people don't take care of their dogs very well. And I really want to change that. Um, and uh, to do that, I've been working on a feature in the game that I'm going to probably announce in a couple of weeks. So look forward to that. But also through our social media. We want to help spread awareness and stuff. And I think that's very useful. Um, the other part of spreading awareness is actual shelters. Now here's the thing, you know, there's a lot of no-kill shelters and some states have even become no-kill. I know uh, Seattle Humane has a goal to make Washington a no-kill state. Um, yeah, a no-kill state. But, you know, there's still a lot of animal shelters, especially in the rural areas that don't have much funding, they don't, um, they might not be doing the best practices. And so, you know, I definitely want to help teach different animal shelters how to train dogs better, how to use their funds better, and that kind of stuff in order to get, um, take a crack at the problem of, you know, making every shelter top notch. And so we can spread awareness and That'll help both individuals and big shelters too, which in the end will save millions of dogs, I think. And then pillar three is another interesting one. I think it's about increasing activity. It's about getting more people to volunteer because volunteering is so important. I think volunteering is one of the best things you can do for your life. If you're depressed, um, volunteering with dogs in particular is a great way to help that. Um, and you meet other people who are like dogs as well, and that helps you like cheer up. Plus, you're actually helping real animal shelters. Um, like, <laughs> it's like a win-win-win, right? 
real animals be helped. You get to go like walk some dogs or clean up after them too, you know, like there's a lot of great things you can do. So one is I want to increase volunteering and eventually I want to do stuff like that in the game, but that's going to take a while. <laughs> a lot longer than I wish, but that's just the way it is. It's a lot harder to make these games than I imagined. The other thing with increasing activity is getting me people to show it to events and donate more to their local shelters. And I think, um, especially in Seattle, there's a lot of events just all the time for a bunch of different animal shelters and, you know, like going to one of these events, sometimes they cost money, but you get to go hang out with dogs and see other dog lovers. So I want to encourage more people to do that kind of stuff too. And that can be done in the app as well. Although that's still more of a long-term goal too with the app. But, yeah, you know, so I think we're well on our way to our vision. It's just, you know, getting more people playing, more people paying, and more people, like, learning about it. That's why if you could share this video with other people, that would be so helpful. And, uh, you know, in fact, just think about someone, one of your friends who loves animals and, you know, would love to make a difference to their lives. You know, have them download the game share the video, and, you know, play together and save together, right? So, yeah, that's really all I wanted to say. I already spent longer than I wanted, but, you know, it's New Year's Day, right? It's a great time for all of us to look where I am, the gym, right? <laughs> I've been slacking on it in the bit of the last year, but I figured, you know, it's a new year, time, a new decade. Ooh, exciting. Anyway, I'll let you guys go. See ya.